Hey, what is going on guys? Slather here. Now today guys, I have another war that I'm going to cover for you guys. Now I came out with the Great 8 Under 8 versus Keemstar War Part 1. And if you want to see that, click on the screen right now. There's an annotation to go to the first one. But guys, today I'm here to talk about the Part 2 of it. Now Great 8 Under 8 came out with a video called Great 8 Under 8 versus Keemstar Part 2. How to really piss Keem off. And in this video, he pretty much attacks Keem once again, calling him a wife beater, saying that he's once again a pedophile, saying that he doesn't care about his fans, quoting him on the horrible things that he said before, being racist. And then he also went on to talk about who really runs Drumler because Keemstar is not allowed to own a YouTube channel after he got so many terminated. And then guys, he tells us to go and unsub from Keemstar and to sub to Scarce. So guys, obviously Keemstar was quick to respond to this video, saying no matter what slam things are said about myself hashtag drummer will always be the number one source for news all others are clones and then guys he said one cannot play the victim if they are the victim this is a well-organized attack and I'm going to find out why. And then guys, he said, I will be responding to these attacks in 15 minutes on stream.me slash Keemstar. And guys, we went to the stream and in the stream, he watched the whole video. And at the end, he said that he's going to sue Grade A under a for slander. He promises to sue Grade A under a. That's right, guys. He said he's going to have a lawyer. He's going to have a legal team. Sue Grade A under A for this video. Now guys, then he went on to say Grade A under A is a liar, manipulator, and a hypocrite. I will be responding with a video and legal action. I've never felt so alone. I want to make a Twitter video explaining, but they will take my words out of context to fit their agenda of slander. Now guys, Grade A under A did not respond, but Leafy is here did on Twitter, subtweeting Keem saying, so after I thought everything is over, Kimi just publicly said that he is 100% suing Grade and getting lawyers on his live stream. And then guys, Leafy posted a picture of Keemstar saying, Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will make me fucking sue you. And then guys, Keemstar came out with this Twitter video responding to it all. I am going to be making a video response to these slanderous accusations, stuff that just isn't true, that can be proven that it's not true without a shadow of a doubt. Um, and it's probably going to come out around Wednesday, all right? And uh, after I come out with my response, I will, in fact, be returning back to Drama Alert. Thanks, guys. Now, guys, in that video, he said that he's going to upload a video addressing everything and responding to those Keemstar Exposed videos on Wednesday. Well, guys, that took a turn because on Drama Alert today, on Monday, he uploaded the video calling out Leafy, calling out Grady Andre, protecting himself, and responding to these exposed videos. He quickly took that video down. Now, the video was called Drama Alert's Deleted Video, Keemstar Exposed, hashtag Drama Alert, the untold story part one of three now big shout out to little pranksters i found the video on his channel he re-uploaded it because i was too late to see that video of keemstar since it was deleted so quickly even though my news team still got it but shout out to little pranksters for that video for that re-upload and guys as i said he made a video addressing everything and after he took it down he addressed it on his twitter by coming out with two twitter videos now guys this is the first one so I sent part one of my response to these Keemstar Exposed fucking videos uh, over to Drum Lord to have it upload it. And as I was watching it, I was like, man, I can't really do this in parts. And I was watching it and I sound like somebody fucking died. I'm like, I don't have enough energy, all right? And I know people are gonna respond to this, you died, Keem, da 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 Like, I, I, get, I get the 13 year old humor, all right? but. I can't do this in parts. I have to respond to everything all in one fucking video. And I need to have a little bit more energy and make it better. So please wait until tomorrow. Thank you. Now guys, he blames Scarce for being the culprit of this all and saying that they all teamed up to go against Keemstar so that Scarce would rise and that Scarce paid them to do this so that he would rise and that Keemstar would fall. So, so you guys, after that reason, he also came out with this Twitter video addressing that. I just had a lengthy private phone call with Scarce and I do not believe that Scarce was in cahoots with these people that organized this plan attack.
and obviously his reasoning was not true like i don't think that would be true in any way like why would scares do that that's way too obvious and scares being the guy he is i don't think he would even think about doing that i'm sure there's gonna be a part three see you guys i'm slather and i'll see you guys in the next news video peace what you want what you need you can just call me and we can meet because you know i got it got it got it got it no i got it got it got it got it what you want what you need you can just